News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 1 p.m. Eastern Time on Wednesday. Three hours left to go in the trading day and one hour left to go until the Fed decision. FOMC, second day of the meeting, finishing up, 2 p.m. Eastern Time. We'll get an announcement. All but assured, the market is, is expecting rates to hold steady, no cut or no hike. Chairman Powell, a press conference at 2.30 p.m. Eastern Time. Should be interesting to see how that shapes the end of the trading day. Right now, pretty muted market as we await that Fed announcement. S&P is negative one point at 31.35. Get the Dow Jones negative by 43 points, trading 27.838. NASDAQ positive by 12, trading at 86.28. Gold contract, gold contract, excuse me, catching a little bit of a bid up, seven dollars at fourteen seventy-five. Notes and bonds, a little bit of higher price and lower yield coming into that Fed decision. The ten-year up five ticks at one twenty-nine oh two. The thirty-year up eighteen ticks at one fifty-eight twenty. We'll start things off. Let's jump over to the indices. We'll start it off with the Dow. It's kind of been a slow trickle since most of the overnight in the Dow. A little bit different than the other indices. You'll see when we jump over. The high in the Dow, 27,975, made just after 3 a.m. Eastern Time, currently 27,846. NASDAQ 100, as you can see, not really a downward slope, just kind of hanging out in this trading range, the lower end at about 83,60. Excuse me, where we were overnight, we trade up to a high at 10 a.m. of 83,95, just off that level of 83,77. S&P is trading at 31.35, made it above 31.40 earlier in the day. There's your gold contract catching a bid, actually made it up to a high of 14.77. Gold trading at 14.74.98. Crude oil, we got the EIA inventory this morning. We saw a surprise build. The expectation was for a draw. You saw the price plummet from 59.12 all the way to a low of 58.12, right about a dollar but it's charged back 58.77 of the price of January crude and the euro US dollar trading 110.92. The headline of the day, as I mentioned it, the Fed expected to hold rates steady and vow to keep short term lending markets stable. That's what they're expected to do. We will find out one hour from right now. Stay tuned, folks. We're going to have a replay this hour. Steve Rhodes is out today. He'll be back tomorrow. But Dave White is going to be live at 2 o'clock, live from 2 till 3. Chairman Powell, press conference at 2.30, and Tom O'Brien, live at 3 o'clock. Stay tuned, folks. We'll be right back.